The scroll will give the deep vision needed to open it. For not even the strongest machinations of the Dwemer can hold off the all sight given by an Elder Scroll. Okay, so, so, so you're saying that if we get this information from an Elder Scroll, we'll be able to open this and get the heart of a god. Or the heart of you and me. Dig Dwemer in the beyond. Although I have to tell you, if if we open this up and don't find something important, it will be your heart. My whiskers are freezing up. Dude, I was about to threaten him and sound really, really ominous. I'm somewhat torn on what to do next, Inigo. You see, we now know there may be an Elder Scroll in a Dwemer ruin somewhere deep below Skyrim in a place called Blackreach. And we access this place via another Dwemer ruin called Altand. And Altand's actually pretty close to here. It's just over there, in fact. So the obvious thing to do is to run straight there and get on with it. However, we have been collecting Dwemer blueprints for better weaponry for Serene. In fact, we have one to return to her right now. And there's this little nagging voice at the back of my head saying, you know when you go back there, she's going to say something like, there's another uh, blueprint and it's in Avtand or the Black Reach or something like that and we've just come from there. And that is going to be very annoying. Is that horse over there yours? Is that Sweet Roll? I think that's Sweet Roll. Of course it is, that's why we dismounted. All oh, right. Yeah. So I sort of want to go back to Riften and um, speak to her first. But that would be insane because as I've mentioned, Alftand is really just over there, near to our field station. And we'd have to go all the way past, probably, Windhelm to, to go to Riften. So we'd almost be at, we'd be, no matter which way we went, to be honest, we'd be so close to Altan, it would feel ridiculous. So we're just going to have to risk the, uh, the, uh, the, the problem of returning to somewhere we've just come from and probably scream and complain a little bit when and if it happens. For now, let's try and get back onto the mainland and get to Alftand. It's strange, if you look at the map, Solitude, Dawnstar and Winterhold are, okay, are all about the same distance north as each other. In fact, Havengar, the hold Solitude is in, is, oh God, right, I think we're going up here. I think we're going up here. Yeah, Havengar is further north. For some reason, it never feels as cold. Okay, probably. It's got a lot more protection from the north wind. At least solitude does. It's on It's on the side of the mountain that's protected from the sea breeze. Oh. I think I'm hearing Sarthal. Oh god, I am actually beginning to freeze. This is... Okay, are we heading in the right direction, do you think? What? Wolves? Uh... I... D don't know whether we're in... Oh, God, you know what? Uh... Kill! 
dying alone? Okay. Yeah, this... Oh, I think that's... I think that's... Right. Alftand is up... Th there. We Ooh. I'm freezing. Oh, my imagination. Dude. <sighs> Don't. Even. Okay, well. Oh, maybe that will get us up there. That will get us up there. What? Okay, I'm never going to get up there. You are a good companion. We're keeping each other safe. Okay, was there some other... What? Bat? That's a door. It's almost as though water slowly dripped down over it and frozen... That's a little... Odd, and also enticing. I'm freezing. I am. Fr Please remember that you are freezing, probably to death. Okay. Actually, I don't think I'm. Okay. You know what? We'll we'll, we'll probably. Okay. Can we? Maybe if we go up there, we can we can nip down and. Let's get inside. Let's let's get inside, warm up, and not get crushed to death by falling rocks. And once we're up there, maybe we can see a way to get to that chest. Okay, this does not look much warmer. Is that steam? Okay. That... Is it sad that I'm actually thinking I can warm myself up by getting close to steam? Okay. This... Uh... Ready to fight, 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 fight them! Yes! Are they the explodey ones? I don't actually think they are. a death, is it, really? They're not actually alive. We've simply disabled them temporarily. Ooh. Still need fragments. Yes, I do. Will this warm me up? Although, if a sudden blast of st is still... Let's stay far enough away that if it suddenly increases, we can jump out. Yes, I found a sauna in a Dwemer ruin. You know, I've missed my Torchbug Lantern. It, it really does give off a very nice, warm glow. You know, the magic lights are very cool and everything, but they really are quite harsh and unpleasant. It's a shame this makes me, well, look like a bipedal Torchbug. I mean, it makes my bottom glow. I mean, you, you've got a jar on. I don't know, somehow you wear it better than I do. I, 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 it just is... Yeah, just, just, I don't know. I think it's just you're a bug in a jar kind of person and I'm not. It's hard to explain beyond that. But I do like the light. And it's a little more controllable, which... Actually, stop playing with the lights. Okay. So... Uh... I'm guessing we got to go up... There. It's a little intimidating, isn't it? 
<clears throat> and I'm. S Dude. Be wary of traps. Because that. Right. There's a button and a plate of gold or is that the person sat here eating it? Lesser ward. Isn't that the ward Tolf did taught me? Could have Okay. And Dragon Cult Patina Ruby of Remedy. Health regenerates twenty percent. It does look rather nice, actually. Uh, do we have one of those? Okay, I am a little thirsty. So this should open the door. And set fire to it. Okay, I'm not seeing any... Okay, is this going to stop at some point? That's not particularly use. Okay, can I... Uh, can I whiz through there? definitely need a press button from very far away spell. Uh, okay. Um. Oh. Dwarven arrows. Did I miss something over there? Dwarven war axe. Pretty sure I've got one. Okay, um. I will be here. Right. I'm wondering, just, 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 what keep... Oh, I'm not totally sure that helps, because... Okay. Can I? I can. Okay, so I can, I can... Okay, this is not... Yeah, you know what? I'm thinking, I'm thinking, uh, fire resistance, and unfortunately, it's not going to last for very long, so, whoa, and, oh, eh, uh, <laughs> okay. Right. No worries. It. I should probably. Okay. No. No. Do. 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 Here I come. Okay. So. What is? Right. Okay. Do not step on those. Because if you do, I have a feeling we're going to be toast. Okay? Just... Please don't. Okay. 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 I don't know whether there's any... 
I'm not seeing any traps. Oh. Okay, it's very dark here. I am. Okay. Well, that wasn't too bad. Okay then. Uh. Right. Brilliant. Never a moment's worry. Right, um, we are still going upwards, which is... Oh, Dwarven Bolts. Which is good, because we want to get upstairs. Buttons. Button. No, buttons! Okay. Oh! Oh, it's, it's... Right, it's not Bernie Bernie, it's... It's Stabby Stabby. Okay. Right. Also Stabby Stabby. A little repetitive. I was expecting something a little... different. Iron ore... Go. I don't know whether... I mean, these are like silver bullion. It's just so damned heavy. And I don't really know how uh, how much gold and silver I've got back at the museum. I know I've got quite a lot. Okay. Dwarven... We didn't destroy this one, did we? No, we did not. This is bigger than I thought. I thought this was just going to be a tower that we climb up and come out and... Voila. Sp do you think we need? Do you think we need spoons? Do you th I, I just the kitchen in the safe house has got lots of dishes and it's got lots of plates and goblets. I don't think I've ever collected spoons. I, I, I don't, I will, hey, we, we can try, right? Dwarven mage-like, no, no. Hmm, I think I've got two of those, but you know what? They're, they're weird enough. You know, that's just, just, that's kind of, those are the sort of things that are impressive if you put them on the wall in your house. Get a few more of those. Won't go amiss, will it? I mean, it's damned heavy, but. Okay, we've got those wall sphincters. Oh god, I missed. Feel free to hit it! Feel free to hit it! Or shoot it! Taking this place by storm. There's... Get it! Get it! Get it! Get it! Kill it! Danger dealt with. Why don't you use your bow anymore? You you don't seem to use your bow anymore. It's it's it, is this because I took the ebony arrows off you? You do have a... You... You... Let's just... Let's just... Dwarven boots... I think I've got... Dwarven boots... Let's just take them just in case. Okay. I mean, you do have arrows. You've got loads of arrows. You... Fork. We now have a fork. We have a spoon, and we have a fork. Not 100% sure what we're going to do with them, but... When has that ever... A dwarven shield? When has that ever stopped me? Where's the dwarven... Saw... Oh, there it is. Dwarven sh... Pretty sure we got a dwarven shield, but again, very impressive looking thing to place. On, uh, on on a wall, so dwarven. But we definitely got one of those, and the thing's bloody and no. Okay, have we got dwarven armor? Pretty sure we've got dwarven armor. Tell me we've got dwarven armor. I've got to check whether we've got dwarven armor, don't I? I'm going to check if we've got dwarven armor. Right after I check, 
Something on your mind? Whether you have arrows. You give me best equipment, yes? Um. Uh, yeah, you've got loads of arrows. You've still got your bow. I can't see your bow. You won't let... Okay. What is next on the agenda? Yeah, you've, you've still got your bow that you won't what let me... What is on your mind? You know, look at, because you probably think I'll take it and stick it in the museum. Okay. Because there's a distinct chance I'd probably take it and put it in the museum. I mean, it's nothing personal. I know it has a lot of sentimental value to you and everything, but, but do you know how rare those things are? Let us go. I don't think we've actually got one on the museum. I, do, I actually do... Whoever it is, you keep ordering ebony arrows from. Could you just order an ebony... Uh, you know, I've actually got enough ebony. I could probably get Yorl and Greymane to um, make one. But I, I still feel that's cheating. Yes, probably getting you to order it for me would be cheating as well. And yet, taking yours wouldn't. Which is weird, really, isn't it? I'm not going to. I've no intention of, because, you know, you're my friend, and also you'd murder me. But I'm just saying, isn't it interesting? I, I would feel like that was earned, whereas if I paid someone and gave them ebony and told them to make the bow, I'd feel like I cheated. Do I have issues... The only thing we're missing from the Dwarven collection is the Dwarven crossbow. So we have everything. We can probably drop the shield and the boots. I kind of want to keep the two-handed sword. Again, it just, it's the sort of thing that looks good on a wall. Oh, no, this feels... Power like Okay, store it. I'm feeling a breeze. I'm feeling a breeze. I think we've made it out. Okay, then. And we're also a little warmer. Shadow is down below, but... Excellent! We've met... Ooh, ooh, ooh. Before we do, before we do anything... Don't, please don't push me. Don't. Whoa! Dude! I was gonna say, don't push me off. Maybe I should have added, also, don't jump off. I think you can get round, actually, in a go. I think you can... Whoa! How did you do... Did you... Did you... Did you get up there? Cat-like agility, right? Because I think, I think you could just go around. I think you can go d down there and around and up. Actually, I think. Okay. This air is pure and clean. It is, and the ground is cold and slippy. So, let's be... Cautious. You make me so nervous when you run at me like that. This... Where is it? Where... There was a ledge. There was a ledge with the... You know what? Oh, no. No, no, no. No, no. I'm... Oh, I thought I was stuck. Let's just have a quick... Yes, it is going to annoy me ever so slightly, knowing there's a chest. Okay, nice. Nice, you're using a bow. I like that. That's good. Why are you staying there? In again. go. Just... Okay, I will try not to start any trouble. Duh. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't start any trouble. Not, not right now. Okay. Bloody ice wraith. Oh. Okay, feel, feel free. Start trouble. Start ice trouble. Serpent. You could have shot it. You could have shot it. Are you okay? Have you got it? Ooh. 
Thank you very much. Uh, you did me mean, right? Seeing as, uh, you know, I mean, I'm not bragging. I did the killing blow and I snuck up on it and pounced like a hunter. Rather impressed with it, actually. Okay, so there's the roof. Which... Oh, I, this is such a bad idea. This is a bad idea. No, that right. Okay. I don't think I'm. Oh. I can get it, but then I'm going to have to go. That is a worrying. I tell you what, I'm just. I'm gonna do it. It will. It will annoy me. For eternity. Oh God, please. Don't. Is it? Is no. Okay, I'm. Just, no, 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 no. Okay, made it. Apprentice. I'm just taking everything. I. Th Whoa. Whoa. Is this? You don't think this is one of the treasure chests marked on the maps, do you? I'm, I'm, I'm going to slide around. I, oh yeah, I'm not going through there again. I'm, I'm going to come around. Yeah, no, I'm going to come round. Okay, you stay up there. Don't worry about it. The horses are down here anyway, so I, I will, I will come up. Is this going to be a case of, I'm going to find these treasure chests and then figure out which treasure map uh, pointed to it rather than the other way round. I have a distinct feeling that is what is going to happen. I think I'm being chased by an ice wraith. Okay, let's just let's get back up here and yeah. Isn't that Langley's place? I think that's Langley's place. Right. Try not to annoy the wolves, and this is his. Okay, that's the tower we came up. So the end. Okay, it's some hunters arguing with some wildlife. Yep, no, 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 they're, they're, they're doing their... Okay. Yeah, this is... Right. You don't scare me, you walking rug. What? Right. What? Okay. And... Spriggan... Okay, she's... God. Stop chasing the... See, I was gonna just calm it. I was gonna calm it and then kill it, but then it just lay down and looked adorable. Yeah, I know, they're bears, they're really annoying. Exercise they are getting. Oh, it's gonna. My legs are less enthusiastic. Okay, okay. Look, can you can you call sweet roll? Just, just. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is about these the wildlife. When they're all snarly fangs, they're just Her horrible. Nervous about this area. Who the hell is that? His ears are shaking. Okay, they don't care about us. We don't care about them. But but when they do something like just. Lie down and look cute and adorable. It distracts me from. That looks like an elevator, right? That looks like an elevator. This looks like a disaster. I sometimes have a bad memory. Too much skooma back in the day. Forgive me if I sometimes repeat myself. Yeah. 
This was the site of some event. I, oh. Expedition Manifest. We've managed to secure the site and hold off any others who, uh, who may try to steal our discoveries. So far, especially those from the College of Winterhold, who seem to think the glory of exploring every ruin should be theirs alone. The crew for our expedition is as follows. Sulla Trebatius, myself, expedition leader. Umana, my constant companion and bodyguard. Valley, a mage not associated with Winterhold, took some time to find. Entrast, Entrastia, yeah, a fellow explorer of some local renown. Yag, a great brute of a woman, hired to keep the rest of the labor in check. Jadar and Jazar, two Khajiit brothers hired as labor. Need a couple more laborers. Getting through the ice is proving difficult. We've set up shelter and scouted the area. Small ruins on the lower plateau of the glacier don't seem connected to the main structure, and we haven't managed to find a way into the tower parapet we found here. Yag mentioned spotting a fissure in the glacial wall that may lead into the ruins, so we were going to find a way to get down there with the gear. Looks like a storm is coming. Was it the storm that ended them? I'm very cold. Probably because I took off my cloak. Yep. Right. Ooh, before we go anywhere, remind me to put some stuff on Shadow Mate. Alright, so this Yeah Emergency Exit. And they may have found or cleared away in oh right yeah that's going to be the way in let's just dump some of this heavy stuff on shadow mirror i have this strange feeling that we may be down there a while and and I would like to be as uh, light on my feet as possible. Partly so that I'm agile, nimble and graceful, but mostly so I can carry more junk. On the bright side, it won't be that cold down here, I assume. Actually, I mean, it can get quite cold underground. It's just you don't... Oh, good grief. You don't have a frozen wind hitting you. Okay. Let's... We have no idea what we're going to be facing down here. I'm going to assume... Dwemer contraptions... And possibly Falmer. Yes, I'm hanging around a lantern hoping to warm up. Okay. Dwarven metal ingot. Ooh, snow breeze. Yes. I've got lots of those back at the museum, just, uh... Now I'm spending a little more time on the northern coast. Right. So, whatever happened here... ...happened above and below. They were either attacked from somebody coming to uh, loot the place, or they unearthed something and it came out and ended them. No, I'm still frozen. I am still freezing. Could do with finding a nice fire pit. These are human remains, and there's a lot of blood everywhere. 
which is a bad sign. They didn't freeze to death, is what I'm saying. Not unless cold has gotten a lot more dangerous and a lot more, um, shall we say, expeditious in the way it kills. Like it's given up slowly sapping the heat from you and has just decided, you know what, I'm going to rend you limb from limb. Okay, not seeing anything. What I'm looking for is a conveniently placed journal. As we've mentioned before, the Nords are actually surprisingly good. Ah! <laughs> Just got this feeling, got this feeling there'd be something around here. We tried to get through Glacier at the top, but couldn't find any way into the tower parapet. Yag spotted in the glacial wall. Yag spotted in the glacial wall and construction of the catwalk was finished just in time for a storm to hit. At first we thought to wait it out, but it has only gotten worse. A shift in the glacier took out several of the new labourers. I ordered everyone to quickly move as much of the supplies as we could into the fissure, and we managed to get most of it. One of the hands decided he wasn't going to listen and tried to make it through the storm, but got blown off the catwalk by the wind. Looks like we are well and truly stuck in here. But for all that, I feel even more driven that I should be the one to uncover the mysteries of this ruin. I'm tired of all the credit for my work going to the mages or the legion. It will be my name that goes down in the history books for this discovery. Wrong. It should be mine. On behalf of... Um, I'm thinking Explorer's Guild. Yeah, not the Mages Guild. I mean, that's the advantage I have here. I'm kind of in control of most of the, shall we say, scholarly. Eh, I've already read that. I've already got that. The uh, I'm in charge of most of the scholarly bodies in Skyrim now, I believe. In fact, realistically, I control most of the information in Skyrim. Okay, you know what? I'm going to stop patting myself on the back now and start making sure nothing stabs me in the back. Also going to try not to get blood all over my boots. Not... What is it? I know you were trying to keep it for yourself, Jizar. You always try to keep it for yourself. No. There's got to be more school. Shut up! Shut up! Don't like me, Jazar. You hit it. Always try to steal it. Okay. That's the laborer. And apparently he's um having a bit of a well withdrawal issue by the sounds of things. Ah. Oh. It would seem we're going to have to go around to find them and find what happened to them. Because if we can find what happened to them, maybe we will have a better chance of stopping it from happening to us. See, that's the... That's the Basis of civilization. Learn from everybody else's mistakes. People think it's learn from your own mistakes, but I've generally found most people don't survive their own mistakes. It's the people one step behind them who tip. Then I suppose I could convince you to go first, could I? Probably not. But yeah, it's the people following behind who think, yes, that was a bad place to stand, wasn't it? Ooh. Yes. It's, it's, it's nice to be warming up. Oh, nope, still a little chilly. Oh, no, no, no. I'm tired. Really? Oh, well, that's going to be annoying, isn't it? 
because we will not be finding a convenient place to sleep down here. That was... You know what? I really would like to find an alchemy bench. Dwemer Inquiries, Volume 1. Ah, I have a feeling someone got through there and then the door was... secured after they entered and then promptly died. Research Notes. Dwarves, Volume 2, I have it. Dwarven got... Everything Dwarven I already possess. Do not need anything else. Okay. Is there anything else? Okay, well, let's just move these books because I feel like this... There it is, Soul Gem Fragment. And... Nothing else at... Oh, hello. Almost... Missed you. I may be missing those. It's either those or the boots I'm missing for the full set. That's, I'm so glad that you're using the bow again. Okay. If only Umana would have left one of these dwarven machine creatures intact for me to study. Yes, it would have. It would have been so helpful. I'm sure. You know, once it stopped trying to murder you. The fact that they almost killed those Khajiit brothers in the middle of the night doesn't mean we couldn't have found a way to disable one. Yeah, the, 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 the general tactic for disabling one is hit it very hard, or have somebody else hit it very hard. We dragged some stuff in front of the pipes they came out of to stop them coming back. They are simply fascinating. It is just the... It just as Calcimo described in Dwarves V2. Their appearance does in fact resemble that of an arachnid. I had thought that to be an embellishment given by his source. The inclusion of the soul gem into the designs of the apparatus is quite remarkable. It could explain the focus for the lightning that he describes. Oddly enough, it doesn't appear to be the main power source for the apparatus. Perhaps some sort of harmonic resonance with the energies contained in the soul gem to bring heat to a small boiler. Too early to say conclusively. That does raise the question of where they get the liquid for the boiler, however. Huh, that was strange. I thought I just saw something moving beyond the barred door. It looked vaguely humanoid. I wonder if it could be an undiscovered automaton. I'm going to move my bedroll down here to see if I can catch another glimpse of it. This is all so exciting. Yeah. It, it's, it's that... Curse of the Archaeologist thing again. Really, really is. There's just, there's something about people who are fascinated. I was about to say, there's something about people who are fascinated by history that makes them eager to join it. Unfortunately, I find myself wondering if I'm describing myself 